TV. Subscribe to Malik Wilson TV. You betcha, I went out of focus. Okay, there I am. <laughs>
I was talking to uh, London Brown today for at least like an hour and a half. Um, he uh, he actually played in Ballers, uh, The Hustle, uh, Mary Xmas. Um, he will be in Power. He was supposed to be filming in Power, filming with the cast of Power this month or something like that or something like I can't remember but uh, you know due to COVID-19 they had to cancel shooting because it was in New York City and stuff like that so um, he's just been at the crib just chilling in LA but um, we got to chop it up some he let me pick his brain um, I actually have the interview that I'm gonna post my dumb tale um, in the middle of me recording like our interview uh, my manager called me and I forgot to press the screen record button again to start the interview back up. So if you do watch that video when I get done editing it. All right, thank you. But if you do watch that video when I get done editing, um, it will just it'll just be audio. So uh, don't fry me. But that it'll be a great video for you to watch if you're into acting or if you just want to be it's a great successful story like he just talks about his life his success um how he got to where he is in the media world um with you know television movies um act, he does television movies he's a radio host um he's a dancer and what else is he um i'm missing one key part uh, i can't remember but yeah he's He's pretty big time in, in LA. Um, he's known in the movie world. He kind of talked about, you know, jumping from agent to agent, um, trying to, um, the thing about agents, like when you find an agent, like you have to make sure that agent is going to work for you and y'all have like a 50-50 relationship because he gets you paid, but you also get him paid. And so it shouldn't be you out here working for yourself and you pay him for the contracts that you get. It doesn't work like that. So he kind of he we, we talked about that and you know, like I said, the road to his success and things like that. So uh, so yeah, that lady's out here taking pictures of cars. Like what is going on? But uh, but yeah. So um, I kind I talked to him. I talked to a guy named Carl Wolf. He's a Canadian. He's like one of the number one Canadian music artists right now in Canada. Like he knows Drake. He knows uh, you know Bieber. He knows Tory Lanez, uh, The Weeknd, like he said, they've all, sorry, all it's dark, but he said, you know, they've all, you know, <clears throat> are like that, you know, they're cool type people. I got an interview with him. Um, he's trying to elevate his music career to, um, to America, you know, the big, the big leagues, the big leagues is what he basically called it, but I got an interview with him. Um, I don't know if y'all know Life Coach Sonya, got an interview with her. Um, she's basically like a, uh, basically like a life coach. She has thousands of followers, um, and she's an influence to a lot of people. Uh, I've been doing like, a, I don't really, I didn't really know these people until, uh, their agent hit me up and, uh, where their media agent, they have multiple agents, they're big time, <laughs> but their media agent hit me up and was like, uh, you know, giving me this bill on these people. Trevor Hurst, who played, who uh, was the lead singer for Econolon Crush. I'm all over the place, but he toured with, you know, Kiss. Um, ah, I can't think of the other bands, but like these are like big time people that people know, and I got them right here on my channel. So um, I'm gonna put that stuff together, edit it up. Uh, Y'all, you know, be sure to go look at those videos. They really. I really got a chance to pick their brain and it's kind of like a once in a lifetime type of thing like you know one thing that me and london were talking about is that although what you're doing right now may be small god is always setting you up for the future for something bigger so what might seem small right now as far as you know interviewing people that you guys may not even know um it set me up for the future to learn how to you know talk to uh, if I do go in this field of, you know, um, celebrity interviews and stuff like that, um, which I, I don't know, I'm trying to be the one getting interviewed, but uh, if I do go into that, you know, I know how to ask questions, I know how to communicate, I know how to 
um, I know how to grasp their attention to make it more so not an interview, but more so a uh, like a relationship, like a friendship. So we're having like a, 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 a genuine conversation. So it's, it makes our our it makes me and their relationship stronger, and it plugs me into different things. But it also makes the viewer want to watch more because it's like, oh, I wonder how long they've known each other, or oh, like he's asking some great questions, or he's giving some great answers, stuff that he probably wouldn't, or he or she probably wouldn't have, you know, told anyone else without that type of relationship. So I don't know. This is just a little bit of motivation. I hope, you know, you guys, once I get done with the editing, it's going to be about 30 minute videos probably. But uh, just go over there and watch the videos when I get done with them and just just listen, man. God is really working in my life. I am super blessed. Um, and it's really just stuff that I've been praying for and, you know, I'm just working towards it. Like I said, faith without works is dead. So I'm not trying to be on here talking you guys head off. I'm just, I just wanted to kind of fill you in on what my last couple of days have been like. I ask that you keep liking these videos, sharing these videos. Uh, if you're new to this channel and you're just tuning in, uh, we're about to go up. So you might as well subscribe. And yeah, you know, I'm excited for 2020. 2020 has started off kind of rocky, but we still, we still got what, six more months to go? Or no, I'm way off. I'm tripping. What is May 5? We got seven more months to go. So I might, my math might even be wrong. I don't know. But yeah, be sure to like this video, share this video, stay tuned for these future videos because they're coming. It's going to be heat. You feel me? But my battery's about to die. Y'all be blessed. Keep me in your prayers. I'll keep you in my prayers. And yeah, you dig?